Wow. You know, James, I'm really getting irritated with you. <laughs> I want to know what instantiates gonna, the causal okay, principle so snake. Dudes. Okay, Duncan, I hope you don't quit. Don't quit. Don't quit. I, I muted you, Duncan. It's just that. Give me one second. It's Isn't it fair that it, the snake would get to ask some questions as well? Like, yeah, I've, ha- I've been answering his questions. Okay. Then he makes his assertions, I think- and I ask him, <laughs> I want to know oh, no. where he gets his Hold assertions from. He said something's I necessary. Think- <laughs> I, I want to know I what know you the simple... <laughs> I'm sorry for muting you again, but... Um... <laughs> it's... <laughs> It's only yeah, that. James, you're g- James, you're giggling like a little schoolgirl. I can't help it. It's the way I giggle. Okay. Yeah, well, J- James, the uh, owner of the YouTube channel of Modern Debate, he, he has the uh, moderating skills of a 14-year-old. Yeah. I mean, I, by I, the way, I popped back in on YouTube, and I said, is this still live streaming? And he goes, yes. He starts g- d- g- d- giggling. And I said, you are the worst moderator. You're terrible. Then they muted me, and then I left. Yeah, I, I understand, but I, I also try to understand his side. I mean, it must be hard to moderate. You're, you know what? You are dumb. Grow a few brain cells. You are just stupid. No, I, I'm, I'm on your side. I'm not trying to. No, you're not on my side. There's no understanding his position. He's a terrible moderator, and when these people behave badly, okay, and I, I, mm-hmm. I confront the other person with their bad behavior. What does he do? He comes down on me. He does this every time. Yeah. Wake up and smell the coffee. Well, the comments are going to be biased probably too. So oh, all- I don't, I don't care. James, James I, I'm, I'm really pissed off at James. Yeah, his forehead is pretty big as well. Uh, demolishing, I, sir. I have a question. Sure. You got. Uh, in your next debate, will you choose your moderator? Um. Well, I'm not going to be appearing on Modern Day Debate unless I got a public apology from James, which he, he which in all likelihood he he will not do, because he's he's a clown. He's a little girly man. Do you hear him giggling on the microphone the whole time? Uh, yes, sir. Yeah. I'm, at, I'm disgusted with him. He promised me he would screen the next interlocutor. I was royally ticked off. I said, I want somebody who's going to debate like an adult. Okay? I don't expect somebody to agree with me. I want somebody who is an adult mind. Not what we saw on display here tonight. What we saw here tonight was a 15-year-old trapped in a 22-year-old's body. He's 22 years old. 22, 23, and arrogant as the day is long. And when I explained to him how certain concepts that he had were a no-go, okay, I impacted. He didn't care. He was just sitting there I'm, I'm, I'm pissed because this is the third time it's happened when I insisted on him. You want me back on your show? Get me an adult interlocutor. Instead of these man boys, okay, these little boys trapped in adult bodies who all they ha- know how to do is be sniveling obnoxious. I certainly expect that there's going to be these little these little internet trolls like Snake is right, okay, because he has a grotesquely overly inflated opinion of his own intellectual skills. What I'm really pissed about is James, because he promised he would screen my next debate partner, and it would be somebody who would debate in an adult fashion. Like, are no, you? I'm not. Listen, I don't care if I'm on live YouTube. I'm not going to take crap, okay? Whether whether it's from an interlocutor or James, the moderator, and I was far more patient than you can even imagine. James I... is an utter disgrace, absolute disgrace. I would not expect any sincerity because most of these fuckers just want to go through their ha ha snark snark group. I'm talking about the moderator. You know, Snake is a, is a, is a is a little typical arrogant snot nosed little atheist 
who knows nothing about the basics of theology or, or philosophy and just shoots his mouth off. Yeah. You know, he says, and, well, nothing, nothing cannot exist. Well, why not? Well, because something exists. So why? Why, why couldn't everything just stop existing all at once? Uh, did you tell James that you're not planning to come again on his show? Not yet. But okay, he, knows, he, doesn't know. he, if he knew he knew how pissed I was the last time. He knows how pissed I am now. So he can he can surmise what my attitude is. And I, after after the show tonight or tomorrow, I'm going to I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to send him a, a good verbal lashing. I am royally pissed at him. He promised he would up his game moderating. He promised he would screen my interlocutors. He would get an adult uh, person. He did not do that. He did not do that in any shape or form. He totally violated my trust. And why do you even agree with debates with these uh, random, um, like, you, you don't even know? Because, because, because I'm a grown man, I have an expectation that people are going to debate on these live YouTube shows like adults. Hey, Darth, can I say something? Go ahead. Anybody can. Hey, trolls out there. If you think your Darth is mad, I'm a whole degree higher than him tonight. So oh you God. guys need to climb the fuck down. <laughs> um... And I am dead serious. I will lock you out of VC if you cross me. We've had an increase in trolls for some reason. Even yesterday, we had a lot of like <clears throat> trollish behavior. Like just that's okay. We have the power of the mute. That's all that matters. Yeah, there's a lot of raids going. So, but uh, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna. Yeah, James James Kunz was was an absolute disgrace. He conducted himself like an absolute girly man. He's terrible. You know, it, it'll be interesting to check out the comments and see what uh, the reaction will be from the uh, audience. They already know what they're gonna say. They already know what they are. The, the <clears throat> ninety-eight percent of they're the comments are unhinged, deranged atheists. They're a bunch of deranged idiots. You can't argue to say they lie. <laughs> They can't argue they wear a wet paper bag for nothing. I will start muting the trolls in chat if you guys don't calm the fuck down. James clearly can do what he want with his shell, but I think it would be a total embarrassment for him to leave that up. I agree. I, I wanted to give you props, uh, demolishing. Uh, I wish James had treated you better. It was kind of oh, sad I, to I, see I, it fall I, apart I, like I, that. I, I, I appreciate that. Um, he was actually acting just terribly, giggling multiple times like a like a schoolgirl. Believe it or not, this guy is going. This guy is allegedly shit. going for a PhD in industrial psychology. Okay, and he's <sighs> acting like a little girly girly man. Now, look, what we had, what we had was a little boy in a twenty-two-year-old's body being snarky, obnoxious, and obnoxious. It's just simply repeating all of his scripted lines that he has on his YouTube channel. That's it. But, but you know what? I'm not really pissed at, th at this little punk. I come across these little punks every single day like toenail lint on Discord. He's nothing new. There are a dime a dozen. But what I'm pissed at is James, who professes to be a Christian, and he's claiming to be a moderator. And I told him, I don't want to appear on your show again unless you're going to screen my interlocutors and get me a serious opponent. I said, I don't want a train wreck that happened like the last two or three times. And he said, OK, I'll get somebody serious. Now, does anybody think he screened this numb nuts? Did he warn this numb nuts? You're not interacting like an adult. No, it's, 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 it's all have, about content. He doesn't, have, point. he doesn't have the balls to do it on on live on live stream. Duff, I would. Duff, here's what point. I think the problem is: you are probably one of the most, if not the most, polemical Christian on the internet, and a lot of these atheists um, have a basic understanding of what type of questions you're going to ask, and when they don't want to deal with them, given your polemic nature. 
they react to you in that specific type of way that they wouldn't react towards oh, other okay. Christians. All right. So, okay. So dark ocelot, you said, stop being a train wreck. No, I'm not being a train wreck. I'm justifiably and righteously indignant at the failure of somebody who's running a debate show to keep his promises. Yeah. Now you're saying be serious and maintain a serious, uh, and maybe a serious debate can, can happen. What the hell are you talking about, Dark Ocelot? Open your microphone and respond to me. Otherwise, you're just a drive-by troll. And you're going to be put in the mental in the mental ward, and you won't be able to type any more trolling remarks. You're going to answer me on mic? No, you're a little girly man hiding as a keyboard warrior. Yeah, he's been running his fingers over. The Good. Now you're now, now you're go, now you're now you're now you're now now you're going into the mental war because you're just a keyboard warrior. Yeah, I'm really pissed at James. Yeah, if you're gonna have a debate channel, the very least you can do is, well, <laughs> not anything that he did tonight. You, it's you'll forgive me for you forgive me for being repetitive and redundant. This isn't the first time it's happened. Exactly. This has happened two or three times. Okay. And I said, get me an adult to debate. To debate. Well, Not he doesn't these want weasels. To. He just wants to make content and have cool uh, little gotcha clips to get more views. It's not a matter of intellectual debate at this point. It's just uh, not trade soda. economics. And it's, uh, it's, it's ultimately pretty sad. He was even muting you when you were trying to talk. I thought that was unfair. That's, yeah. a, that, that's okay. I, I, I really I really am not displeased with myself for showing indignation the way I did. I think it was entirely justified. Will, well, will the so. atheist jump on the will the atheist jump on the bandwagon? Oh, he was raging. I don't care. I really don't care. You see, Darth, you got another person who disagrees with you, saying that you were treated unfairly. You see, it's 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 abundantly clear what happened. I'll flat out say I don't agree with a lot of your points, but I think it's absolutely ridiculous that James acted this way and Snake was absolutely demolished by you. I, I think it's uh, it's absolutely saddening to see this kind of stuff happen and people cheer it in the comments. But if James would have laid down the law on him a little bit more, he would have had at least a bit more pressure to be serious. No, 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 because he, he, knew, he knew that the feckless, spineless giggling like a schoolgirl james wasn't gonna step in yeah james yeah, james james is a disgrace uh bro yeah, you i think that's right that he has out. to apologize for that yeah you, you can't resolve that by just simply saying i'll get you a person you need to apologize for that did, did you ever did you hear him step in once and say snake you have to make a good faith effort to answer the question and, no. and, and not just give some quasi half-baked answer that we know that you're not intending it's an answer. Never once did he jump in. James always leans in favor of the atheist because he doesn't want to make it seem like he's the Christian trying to, you know, he, he, he wants to be the nice Christian that makes it seem like he's not trying to uh, stack the deck against the atheist. So, and instead of being straight down the middle, he has to be more unfair towards the Christian. Exactly. Yeah, that's a good way to uh, word what it. I wanna, what I want to find out from him when I do talk with him in person. Did you interview this person? Did you tell them that Darth Dawkins, Duncan Atheism, is a serious debater, regardless of what you think he is, that he wants a serious adult interaction? He wants a vigorous adult interaction and, and debate and disagreement. Not somebody who's just going to give phony answers and dodge, 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 evade, evade, evade. I'm, 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 so, I'm so accustomed to the snarky teenager mentality, a atheist reasoning. That's not what I'm upset about. It's that James promised he would get me an adult interlocutor. And what do I get? I get a greasy haired, long haired, little effeminate little, uh, guy who calls himself snake like i completely get that there's a limit to how much he can actually like uh screen somebody for a debate but surely he could have done better than this no Especially no what, 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 a, what a real man would have done and said listen 
uh, if you want to debate Dark Dawkins, you're going to have to debate in an, in an adult fashion. And that he has complained before about people being dodging, evading, you know, being less than transparent. And he expects you to debate like an adult, not like a teenager. This is specifically what I told him. And that if you don't conduct yourself like an adult in the debate, I'm going to stop you and cut your mic off. Did James do that? No, because James doesn't have the balls to do it. He just wants to giggle like a little girly man on a, a live YouTube stream. Yeah, like the other guy said made, earlier, he tries to be so unbiased, he actually pushes himself in favor of the opposition so far to the point where he unironically becomes biased. But uh, to look back around, I really do wish yeah. James would have pushed him harder on that uh, when he couldn't answer your question there. No, I James, really James, James, is, James, James is a feckless coward. Yeah, James, you know what? I'm, I, I, I really think James is a scumbag now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Unless I get a public apology from him, I'm not going back on that show. He can go pound sand. He's a clown. He's an absolute embarrassment as a moderator. Oh, by the way, Tuesday night, 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, Modern Day Debate. It'll be me against some clown by the name of Red Venture. Yeah, I'm going to have to make a note of that. I'm glad you reminded me. Is he an atheist? Uh, I believe so. I don't have a high expectations. I think I'm gonna, we're going to see the same crap as we always have. But... And I, I told James, I said, you know, James, if, the, if this guy pulls the same crap that all these other people did, I said, I'm going to give it to you right right on, on the live show. I said, so you better be a better moderator that you, than you've been before. I said, I'm just warning you. 